Militant atheists like to make the claim that God created cancer and evil and all these bad things. And they try to justify it with saying, well, the Bible says God created everything. And then when you ask them, well, did God create the airplane? Some of them go, yes, God created the airplane and submarines and automobiles and all these things created by the creation are suddenly created by God also because they have to justify that God creating everything means that God created cancer and God created evil to justify their position that their claim that God does not exist is a viable um, it's a viable position for them to hold. Anyhow, God did not create secondary and tertiary creations. If you go down the caption, I explain what secondary and tertiary creations are. God did all the primary creations. Now, he did form some things out of the primary creation, like when he formed mankind, we were formed out of the uh, primary materials. But anyhow, evil is a behavior of the creation. So that means the creation has generated evil behaviors. So evil is not created by God. It is created by the creation. Something within their behaviors generate evil, which evil is just wickedness. It's a complete disregard for the ways of God. Or even a partial disregard of the guard of the ways of God is considered evil. So evil is a behavior of the creation, not something that God created. Cancer is also something God did not create. It's the result of lack of maintenance of biological entities. Whenever Adam and Eve chose to reject God out of the world, the maintainer of biology withdrew from the world, and so cancer and other diseases is the result of lack of maintenance on biology. It's not that God created cancer. It's not that God gives cancer to anybody. Cancer is the result of lack of biological maintenance. And we can see this. If you have a poor diet, you're more likely to get cancer than if you don't have a poor diet. That's part of maintenance. But the ultimate maintainer of biology is God. So whenever you reject God out of the equation, you have therefore um, gotten rid of the maintainer of biology. And without the maintainer of biology being present in the world, you're going to get diseases in the biological entities because they're falling apart because there's no maintenance on them. So anyway, like, uh, like when the Bible says that Adam and Eve will surely die if they ate of the tree of the knowledge of good and evil, there were two deaths that they experienced. The first death that, that they experienced was immediate. That was spiritual death, which is the withdrawal of God's presence. So without God's presence, they died spiritually immediately. Then without God's presence, their biology started to degrade because the maintainer of their biology was no longer present. And as a result, over time, their biology kept degrading until they ended up uh, experiencing physical death, which is a total cessation of biological function.